Your Sui White Paper Agency has been crafting paper paraphernalia and lanterns used in Chinese festivals. Established in the 1960s, the paper agency has been passed down to Mr. Yo Hang Tio by his father. In 1941, Mr. Yeo and his father fled to Singapore from Eastern Guangdong Province in China during the Japanese occupation. At 19 years old, he took over his father's business after working there for three years as an apprentice. This is a kind of luck and good luck, and it's like a lamp for the lamp for the lamp. 一些些好好字啊，好好句子这样啊，啊，有的写他们的信，啊，有的又画龙还是画什么都，他们都可以。The lanterns are designed, crafted, and painted by Mr. Yeo alone to ensure that the standard is maintained throughout. The intricate designs of each lantern are drawn carefully onto the lantern before painting. 像他们又画特别的的的东西这样，这这个就是这个啊，凤山寺，就画那个那个凤，呃，站在山顶，哦，起，照它的那个，它它的名称啊，画出来这样。The materials used in making traditional Chinese lanterns include paper, bamboo, paint, and a special glue made from seaweed. Vinegar is added to give it a smoother texture. 啊，有的好像没没办法，啊，应付我就就拒绝他了。孩子那个，我他差不多是有大概啊，有差不多三十八线而已了，还没有，我好像我去搞了，就他们怎样画这样啊，他们还没办法去搞，要写到会自己去搞啊，才才成功。他们读读书了啊。他们又又啊享受啊，有人去的，有比较工作比较轻松一点啦、啊。又好像接着比如说，啊，好像我又又赶工，有时候画得很很迟了晚上。Popular characters drawn on the paper lantern are prosperity animals, words, and family surnames. The tiger is said to be the most difficult of all, as he has to look majestic; otherwise, it would be mistaken as a cat. His artworks were exhibited in London, and he has made a name for himself in the paper making industry. Mr. Yu's trade is one of the many sunset industries in Singapore as they have no successor to pass on their skills. However, he is pleased that his story is getting more media attention and is happy to teach anyone as long as they have passion to learn.